we're back again in another hot sticky day another unit to get this one bought at a live auction the other day I only paid fifty dollars for this one I bought two units that day one for forty dollars one for fifty dollars spent ninety dollars total because they had furniture in them and everybody else that was there they didn't want to deal with furniture so I got these things really cheap got an empty trailer here ready to go the only bad thing is I did not bring a hand truck. I completely forgot to bring the hand trucks. I do have a dolly to roll something, but it's gonna make it a little bit of a pain to get furniture out of there and even boxes. Luckily, it's not a really long ways, but it is down this little hall right here. But we're here, I got Leah with me. We're here ready to load. It's a 10 by 10, like I said, 40 bucks. Okay, I think it's this one right here on the end. Let me find my key here. No, I'm sorry, that's $50. The other one I paid $40. I just, I said 50 at first, then I said 40 again, but it's $50. Doesn't really matter, it's $10 difference. But, but pretty full unit here. Fairly neat too. Everything's kind of stacked up. We got a bar here with just a little bit of weights on it, but we got a not a huge amount of containers and boxes it looks like but there is some stacked in here um mattresses i don't know about them they might not be any good that's an older one it actually looks really clean and furniture mixed in it's a little stool there's a chair there's another chair that's probably going to be a dining set i bet because there's two chairs there um we got a nice here we got an iron bench like a park bench it looks like some kind of exercise equipment more furniture back there it looks like another chair that matches those and let's say fragile glassware glassware but we're about to dig in and we'll see what we find melissa frames take to storage fragile that one says fragile that one says fragile but like i said forty dollars so you know this one one like this is easy money the park bench right there will probably bring 40 or close to it and then just throw one more thing in like these plants right here and you're good to go First container here, let's take a look in this one sitting right here. See if it'll kind of give us an idea on what kind of stuff we're going to find in here. There goes the weights rolling that way. All right, first, just first observation here. It looks nice and neat. We got wrapped up stuff here. We got bubble wrap. So let's see what kind of stuff there is. This might just be a bunch of like glasses wrapped up here though. Well, there's a lid. Some kind of funky lid for something let's see there's another lid i don't know what these go on here's a mug it's a uh, i don't know i can barely read that something would love joanne and more mugs lids i don't know what these lids go on that's a lid See. I don't know. I've never heard of this. Would love Joanne. Joanne Delamba. So I don't know if this is worth anything or what, but that's like a little picture there. So I don't know how many pieces, if it's like a, a tea set of some sort that it makes. Once you put it all together. I don't know. We'll see. But there's several pieces there that all match. Let's see what else is down in here. And it kind of looks like more of the same in there. Oh, there is some clear glass. Looks like some um, cups for a punch bowl. Let's move on down and see what else is in here. We got these little organizers here and yeah, it looks like kind of like punch glasses, but look at these right here. These are nice almost kind of look milk glass looking no marking on that one um right here oh it's pyrex it just says rex there but i think the p and the y are like rubbed off some kind of platter right here um, 
probably isn't, but in this one, it's got lamps in it. Oh, look, there's one of those um, old desk lamps. Looks like the brass lamp with the green glass globe. Those are cool right there. It looks all good. There's another desk lamp in her hand there. A nice stainless desk lamp. Um, this is like a Christmas platter. So lots of glass in this, this container right here. And then this is, I guess you like clear glasses in there. All right, this box says miscellaneous home decor, wire, wire lady, bathroom, garage. Oh, sorry, garbage can, toothbrush holder. Very organized. Nice little bathroom garbage can. It's all bathroom stuff, bathroom set. Okay, jewelry holder. And then we got fragile wine glasses, it says here. That's what it is. And there's something, something else done in there. Okay, there's a fondue pot, and then there is wine glasses, I guess. They just kind of stain a little bit they're painted on. Wine glasses. What is this? Oh, um, file folders. A mug. So nice and neat, nothing too crazy. Oh, oh, this, I thought this was like a candle holder, but it's actually a clock. Looks like a nice clock. It's a mechanical. Let's see if there's a key or anything in it. Or does it have a... Yeah, it's got the holes in the front for a key. Um, no, don't see a key here to wind it with. But it's a Sessions clock. As you can see there. <clears throat> there's something in here, actually. Let's see. Where's that? Something is in here. Oh, there it goes. There's a... <laughs> I don't think that even goes to this. There's a nut in here, but nice mechanical clock there. Maybe we'll come across a key. If not, then you know you can you can get a key for it. But it's a mantle clock, mechanical. That's worth a few dollars there. All right, I moved those plants, and now back here there's some kind of an exercise. Vincent, what is this? Let's see. Press Pro. Some kind of. Ironing board of some sort? I don't know. I don't know exactly what. It's a press pro. Something to do with clothes. Ironing them or something like that. Maybe steaming them. I'm not sure. What was in there? Cake plate like it says. And there. Nothing's for Kevin. But it's a nice cake plate. And more glassware so far lots of glassware and then kind of in this area there's a chair it's got a cover thrown on it and a couch that doesn't look too good so this stuff the living room furniture doesn't look too good it looks kind of worn out a little uh weight bench here looks like all the pieces are there these plants are actually really nice got nice pots on pots that's like an actual clay pot down there so literally probably those two plants right there should be should you know 20 and 20 dollars that should be 40 dollars and i can say that over and over again like the weight bench it should be at least 40 dollars so when you pay this price for a unit i mean it's just so easy you don't even have to worry you just charge whatever and, and roll with it Wine rack, grill set, china glass, dining room. Oh, that's probably the glass to go in a china cabinet, like for the shelves. A brand new little grill set there. Candle 
I've got some picture frames and little picture stands. Looks like in this one right here. Picture frame. Another container here. This one actually has water sitting on the top. So apparently there was some water leaking in this corner right here. See what we got. It's very heavy. Oh, Halloween stuff. We got pumpkins, little bells of hay. Okay, that's why it's heavy because the whole bottom is full of weights. We got a 10 pound weight set. We got the. Here we go. We got the thigh master and then we got the butt master here. And okay, we got a pull-up bar, some some more dumbbells. It looks like a little set of like medicine balls, little weighted balls here. All right, we got some Christmas stuff here. Looks all in good condition. Nice clean boxes, organized. Got a little Hallmark over the moon for you. Let's see if it's in there. Yeah, looks it is in there. But everything in here is clean. Pine cones. Dooney and Burke and it's hooks for ornaments but more stuff down in there there's little nutcrackers there's a bunch of those um, little fresh cut smell boxes with bows and stuff and then just down in here we got individual ornaments monkeys well a monkey and then um, gingerbread men but nice and clean stuff so that'll all all this kind of stuff will sell real easy all right here's the park bench it's actually pretty nice look you got the little pineapples in there inlaid into the back of the seat a little bit rusty especially there because that's where the the it was up against that container and the water was coming down and sitting on that container all right we're digging in here and I just uh, we got some more furniture. This couch looks like crap. I don't know how well it shows up, but it's got it's pretty pretty nasty. But back there in the back, there are more boxes. Another mattress, oh, a bunch of mattresses. But we still got boxes, boxes up there. And more mattresses and then more boxes. So still quite a few boxes here to look at, see what we'll find. Bugs all over the place here. Dead bugs. We got a big old beetle there. We come on down the hall, there's a dead beetle or something, but look right here. I guess this is like a big cicada. And then look at this thing down here. It's like a big old like moth butterfly. It looks more like some kind of a moth type thing, but it's I don't know if you can tell how big it is, but it's huge. Just scattered down the hallway here, and then here's another some kind of beetle. I think. And then there's a bunch of me. There's just dead bugs laying all down this hallway. Brand new luggage rack here. And then this looks like a shelf, like a wooden shelf. Yeah, it like folds out. Just need to wipe off. That's all it, yeah, that's it's upside down, but those would fold down and make a little wooden shelf. That's always an easy sell. And what is this? I, I guess it's a tabletop the other side the back side over here is smooth though. i gotta move this stuff to get to it oh we got a couple of um floating shelves here well we need the brackets for them there's little metal brackets that those use to hold them on so we'll see if they're here well let me set these over here and what is in here it's just a box an empty box for a high chair but this here okay it's a it's a mirror it's a giant mirror there that's probably going to be pretty heavy to pick up. Oh. yeah it's very heavy so i gotta carry that thing out 
But we've gotten three beds so far. Uh, a wooden bed that I already put, took out there. There's a day bed, so here's the piece for it. There's already been two other pieces, this metal day bed, um, and then another metal bed. And then there's a baby crib right here. So three beds and a baby bed. People do the craziest stacking. Gotta get all this furniture. You can't just reach up there and grab it because it's all like intertwined. There's like a table or desk there, but its legs go back around the other furniture. Somehow or another, you got to reach up there and get all this furniture down, but it's all tangled up. We've cleared up this middle section. We got another big batch of boxes here. Some more boxes there. Let me move these couple of chairs. One, two, three, four. There's four more chairs. I, think we've, I don't know if we put one or two on there already. So that's a whole set. Pretty nice little metal and wood dining set. Definitely solid and sturdy. And there's something big up underneath. Up underneath all of this stuff that all this stuff is sitting on. There's like a big block under here. I don't know if it's like a dresser or a desk or what. They got a bunch of blankets on it. Oh my gosh. It's a dresser. It looks like it matches the um, the color on the crib. So it might be like a changing table slash dresser. But it looks pretty nice and clean. And they've got like five blankets on it. But let's look and see what's in some of these boxes. I'm thinking... Might be some Halloween and Christmas over here, but let's look and see. We've already seen some Christmas. Oh, this looks like just some miscellaneous dishes, mixed up dishes. There's nothing to see there. Those are some Corningware cups, so nothing special there. We got a warm steam, and I can tell that's what's in it. Vicks Vaporizer, find them things all the time. Hurricane candle holders. Feels like that's what might be in there. Yep, that's what it is. It says set of two, I don't know if there's two in there. It looks like just one, but I'm not sure. All right, let's keep going. Melissa storage, it says fragile and picks. So, let's see, is it just pictures? It might be just like pictures, you know, with the frames, yeah, so, that are fragile because they have the frames with them. There's some photo albums, a little, <laughs> little finial thing, oh, this is cool right here, a little, um, photo tree, and... I can keep saying this nice and clean and organized. It looks like there's some new frames down in there. And a photo cube. These little things won't go back in there. Alright, I can get way, way up there. About 10 foot high or more. I'm going to have to stand on something again. Let me move this. I keep having to move this nightstand back over there and stand on to reach some of the stuff that they put all the way up in the ceiling. You hate to just kind of pull it over on you because you don't know if you're going to pull like something breakable right on top of your head. Well, those, those were light, so I could have just pulled them off, but I didn't know that. Christmas tree ornaments. And that's what it is. Once again, nice, clean, neat Christmas stuff packed in here. So that is a good thing. Not going to really help me out in the next week or two, but that's good. And this other box that I pulled down, it's just got a couple, a couple plants in it. All right, this one is looks like it's halloween then and it says halloween so this will be one that we can sell here very soon probably about toward the end of august we can start selling this stuff yep it's full of halloween a lighted pumpkin another lighted pumpkin 
This one's tore right here. Oh, it's coming apart, but it can be fixed. A little three-tier lighted pumpkin. And it looks like a bunch of um, costumes here. The cat. Several costumes. Christmas figurines. Fragile is what it says. And it is more Christmas. Christmas cards. Christmas candle. Okay. Um, Christmas soap pumps. I don't see any figurines. Coco Mint Symphony. We got a candle. Never been burned. Kind of smells like cocoa. I haven't seen any figurines in here like it said. That says piece. Two wooden piece pipes. And a hand painted Christmas statue. That's kind of cool. A little wooden stocking holder. Alright, let's see what's in this thing. Wooden piece pipes. That's what it says. And that's not what it is at all. It's a, a broken gnome. A gnome on a rabbit. But this side's good. This side, it's all broken. So that description was completely wrong there. And then here, no Christmas figurines either. So I didn't see any figurines. At least anything I looked at, there's a few things that I missed. There's more Christmas stuff. Maybe this is the figurines. I guess this bag right here is the figurines. It looks like it's probably a manger scene. Yeah, oh, there you go. Manger pieces. Okay, so not really. I mean, there's a manger set, but no other figurines of any kind. No piece pipes in the one box. All right, we got two more boxes on this side. These are big ones. Spare bedroom. And I don't think none of this has anything to do with spare bedroom. We got some jars. There's more jars down in there. They're kind of falling down in there. And champagne vase, seven piece set. That looks cool. We got a Anchor Hawking cake, pl cake plate. I wonder if that's in it, because we already saw that. Maybe there's something else in there. And this is, it's a Dell bucket. Dell Earnhardt Jr. bucket with four pilsners. Okay, that's cool. That's what's in it. That's a good auction item for us there. And let's check this, because I don't know if that's a cake plate or not. Because we already saw a cake plate that was not in the box so there might be something else in there but no it's a oh, no it's not a cake plate it's like a it's a punch bowl i guess all those glasses that we got at the beginning go with this punch bowl right here one last box that was over in that corner just set down decor and accent pieces and candle holders it says bloomingdale's And it's full of it's like little candle holders. This box is really heavy, so I wonder if it's just a bunch of candles in here. Oh, 
Okay, this is a nice coaster set. Look at this. Made in Taiwan. Pomerant or something like that. But they're all down in there. I can see these wooden coasters. So that's those are very nice. And looks like another coaster set here. Glass coasters. And what else is in here? Check out, we got a little brass, brass piece. Oh, look at this right here. It's a Winnie the Pooh. It's like a big ceramic vase or like a, maybe it's supposed to be a um, trash can, but it's got Winnie the Pooh, Piglet, Tigger. See if it's got any Winnie the Pooh stuff inside of it. Nope, but this is cool right here. It's got the little glass with the blue duck. This kind of I've seen stuff like that go decent in the auction. And something else in here. Let's I think this is Winnie the Pooh right here. Oh, it's a Winnie. Okay, so that must be like a waste basket. Here's a Winnie the Pooh. His foot's broke, but the piece is right there. Soap disp um, dispenser, and then here's a soap dish. But it's broken too. So we'll have to see if we can fix it. And then I think there's a, a cup here. And it's got pieces in it. Probably the broken piece off of the other one. Yeah, there's a little cup to put your toothbrushes in or whatever. So that stuff, that needs a little help. And we still got, there is some candle holders down in here. And what all is in this one? Um, it's just gonna be all kinds of decorative stuff. There's all amber colored glass here. I wonder if there's a set of these down in there. I think there is. It was so hot in that hallway in there. We were just pouring sweat. We had to come and sit in the truck and take a, about a 15 minute break in the air condition. And now we're about to go out and tackle the rest of that unit. But it was just, I mean, it's not any better out here, but in that hallway, there was just no circulation and just pouring sweat in there. So hopefully now we can make it, to, make it through the second half of this unit and get it loaded and get out of here and get out of this heat. I'm gonna. Sh I'm showing Leah. She's all covered in sweat. She's sweaty as can be. I'm surprised she's not running from the camera. I guess she figures there's no point in running no more. Hey, baby. <laughs> all right. This is what all we have left. Almost there. These boxes we already looked at. So we just gotta look at those boxes right there. Throw these last few furniture furniture pieces on and we will be good to go. So let's get some of this down. We got a little rolling, that's kind of an odd one. Where you'd hang your suit jacket on. I guess over here you'd hang your pants on and I don't know why it's made so wide like that, but here's another chair. This must be like a big dining set. But I haven't seen the the table for it, just all these chairs. And it's stacked up to the ceiling over here again. All right, another box. This one says Reagan Keepsakes. So do we think it's Ronald Reagan Keepsakes or a little kid named Reagan and their Keepsakes? Probably the kid named Reagan. And that's what it looks like it is. Reagan looks like a little there's some little dresses. We've got a little chair. What is this? We've got a lamp. So, I mean, some of this not really keepsakes, but I guess to them they were. Snickerdoodle. And a comfy crib sheet. Comfy crib sheet. Snickerdoodle. All right, another Christmas box. And once again, nice, clean Christmas stuff. 
angels, wreaths, little trees, and all kinds of stuff down inside the container here. But it all looks clean. I guess, uh, okay, it's like a little can snowflake candle holder. And the container's good, the container's sellable. We just pulled this box down, what do we got? Framed pictures. Okay, so framed pictures, this looks like pretty much what it all is, personal framed pictures. That might be what's in these other two boxes here, more pictures. It says King Bed Linens. Okay, yeah, it's kind of squishy. That's probably what it is. And, yep, it is sheets and linens. And once again, they're all nice and clean. And this one says books, computer, and two dog books, Cisco. This is cool. It's brand new. We got a human anatomy puzzle there. That's a good one. It looks like we do have books, like it was saying. There's a yearbook. Um, yeah, some kind of computer books, like training books. Somebody's maybe diploma. Looks like yearbook, yearbook, 1996 yearbook, 1995, 94. So there's all your books and there's some maps in here. We're all about Atlanta. Snow. Up here on the top we did just find this big old plush snowman. Uh, he might be just a little bit dirty. He's got some cobwebs on him. He's got like a weighted base so he'll stand up. But he'd probably need a little bit of cleaning. He has plastic on him but it's kind of falling off. But still pretty cool. He's about three foot tall. I don't know how well you can tell in the video. In the box here, let's see. What do we have in here? Is it just one? I think it's just one vase in here. It's just a big clear. literally just a big old clear vase in this box here with some wrap. That's it. Then we got the um, Christmas train here. And yeah, it's in there. It looks like it needs maybe a couple pieces need a little help. The little Christmas train. And the last box here, this looks like it might be baby stuff because it says Reagan's room on it and Reagan appears to be a baby so What are we gonna find? We got some stuffed animals That's one of those little I think you pull on it, it plays music or something Okay, so it makes all kinds of sounds. A baby doll. What is this? You have all kinds of baby blankets. Snickerdoodle canvas art. And it says D-A-Y-E. I don't know if that's like a last name or what. But mostly just a bunch of um, baby sheets and stuff it looks like down in here. Blankets. Here's another piece of art, I think. No, it's just like a big tray. And a, a foam, like a little golf club here. And that's it. So once again, like I said on the other, nothing real exciting. What's that? Yeah, that was in there. But that's it, I mean, there's some more furniture back in here. We're going to dig all this out, load it on the truck, 
and that's the dresser okay oh here's the table right here there's the leg sticking out and there's the tabletop so there is there's like one two three four there, there's uh, there's at least six chairs for this table so that right there that's probably at least a hundred dollars i mean depending on what the top looks like but some more furniture over there there's some chairs stacked up there's some blankets nothing else exciting but that's how it is sometimes with storage units sometimes they're just regular old stuff actually most of the time it's just regular old stuff um sometimes you throw a few weird thing is every now and then you get somebody that just has really eclectic weird taste or really expensive taste but a lot of them are like this just regular old stuff everyday stuff and but it pays the bills so that's it for this one give us that thumbs up if you like this one if you want to see more videos like this then hit that subscribe button leave a comment if you have a question y'all have a good one